What you are watching is modern day college football recruiting. What's going on? It's Kyle Henderson of Bama Football on YouTube. And what you're watching is the second upload of this video because the first time I uploaded it, the audio wasn't good on the back end. And I thought about leaving the video, but I was like, you guys deserve the ultimate standard. So I'm recutting the video and here we go. Okay, so what you are watching is modern day football recruiting. Again, Kyle Henderson, Bama Football on YouTube. Coach Kalen DeBoer, what he's got going on is phenomenal. And this is the main reason that Alabama is absolutely on fire and really didn't um, lose any type of momentum after Coach Saban left in terms of recruiting because they put together such a great pitch in terms of their marketing efforts, how they're how they were going to continue the brand of Alabama football, all right? So what you are watching right now, a video from Justice Terry, his mother, put this video together on social media. It went viral. Here are all the prospects. We're going to talk about them in this video as well. And you're going to see Justice Terry walk out. This is at the Alabama football field house, right? They're calling out his name. There's music. And it's just kind of like the NFL draft. And as you will see, he is walking up to the podium with Coach Kalen DeBoer. So Caleb DeBoer is going to be up at the podium, okay? And Kalen is going to give him a jersey, and it is going to say number one, right? Like, this is amazing. This, this is uh, key marketing. Like, who, whoever is putting together this idea and this think tank, uh, this is really amazing stuff. So courtesy of Justin Terry, uh, Justice Terry and his mother on social media. So everybody keeps asking inside the comment box because I'm always looking at the comment box. And by the way, he's giving a shout out to, like, his family members. This is amazing. They're like, uh, why do you keep saying cold summer? Well, Courtney Morgan who is the general manager of Alabama football, uh, he's put together the marketing effort saying Alabama cold summer. And you'll see this on a lot of his tweets that he tweets out. See, hashtag cold summer. And I get it. It is 95 degrees in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. I live here, right? And it is hot as it's ever been. But on Twitter, he's put together this cold summer. And I love it. So Courtney Morgan has ties to Michigan, was ge the general manager at Washington under coach Kalen DeBoer, right? And he comes here with that same title as general manager. His job is to take care of the roster, the players that are here, but also the recruiting efforts. He has a huge personality. Players gravitate towards him. Everybody gravitates towards him. Um, and he's doing a hell of a job helping Alabama build this class of 2025. When you look to the prospects, and we've talked about this before, that are on commitment watch, you have Dawson Merritt, who's a four-star. He's a linebacker. Micah DeBose is a four-star offensive lineman. Ty Haywood. And while we don't anticipate Ty Haywood, who's a five-star, to commit anytime soon, he has been predicted to be... Uh, to the Alabama Crimson Tide in this class of 2025, which would be monumental. You look at the overall prospects um, that are here in Tuscaloosa right now. You have Kalik Lockett, who's a five-star, uh, was just here on Monday. Same thing with Caleb Edwards, who's a five-star. Dijon Lee. It's critical for Alabama to roll out the red carpet for all of these players, but specifically to John Lee, who will make his announcement on June 28th. Uh, Caleb Cunningham also in town. Justice Terry, as we just talked about. Ty Jackson, Derek Meadows, Micah DeBose, Abdul Sanders, Luke Metz, Antonio Coleman. Those three at the bottom of your screen are committed to the Alabama Crimson Tide already. Back to uh, kind of the opening. What Coach Kalen DeBoer is doing right now is phenomenal in terms of the recruiting pitch, the recruiting efforts. And look at the chess piece that Coach Kalen DeWar has put in place to solidify this class of 2025. You have Jamarcus Shepard. Everybody saw the video that just went viral of him recruiting um, Travis Smith. You have um, uh, Mo Linquist, who's been doing a great job on, on the defense with the defensive secondary. You saw him smoking a cigar with Chuck McDonald's pops. Kane Womack, he has the energy. Nick Sheridan, he has the energy. You've heard what Jalen Milrose had to say about his quarterback coach and offensive coordinator. So overall, the momentum is at an all-time high here in Alabama. Uh, Mo Linqua said that this weekend is going to be legendary in terms of the recruiting. They have so much momentum and uh, really great to see because if you're an Alabama football fan, you were curious. How is Coach Kalen DeWar going to work springtime? How is he going to work the transfer portal? Let me ask you this. Are you happy with what he did in the transfer portal? I am. I had questions about the special teams. They went out and got the Lou Groza Award in Graham Nicholson, right? So, um all these guys coming in, um, big time 
additions. And 2025 is looking very prosperous. This class is climbing weekly in the recruiting rankings. And I wanted just to jump on here because this video was absolutely fire. Had to throw a reaction uh, together. And I appreciate you guys. Look, um, I had to get the re-upload. You guys deserve perfection. And uh, I want to bring it to you on the, you know, on the highest level form right here on Bama Football on YouTube. That's the standard, right? So always getting better and having that tunnel vision to just talk Alabama, Crimson Tide Football. Kyle Anderson of Bama Football on YouTube. If you could pause and drop a thumbs up, I really appreciate it. And uh, I'll catch you soon right here on Bama Football on YouTube. Turn the notifications on because I think there's some news coming your way uh, pretty soon. Kyle Henderson, Bama Football on YouTube, right from Tuscaloosa, Alabama. I'll catch up with you guys soon.